guys, back at it again today, and there is the Equinox Hunter. That is John uh, out here at the same park where we're the other day. And uh, let's see if we find anything. See you here in the next one. Hi right, guys, so it's got my first good signal. It looks like I got myself some type of cross. I'm not sure if it's silver or not. It was ringing up about a 12 or 13, so most likely not. But it looks like it's some type of pin or something that goes on. I don't know. Maybe a shirt or something, but pretty cool find. So I got that and also got a quarter. So uh, let's go find something else. All right, guys, it's got another target right here. Not sure if it's like a bracelet or some sort. Kind of looks like it went to a bracelet or something. It's got some type of design on it. Going to clean it up and see what it is, but uh, it was ringing up about a 12 or 13, so it was pretty deep down. So if I can figure out what it is, then uh, we'll see you here in the next one. All right, guys, so I cleaned it up, and it looks like it's some type of old bracelet. It's definitely plated. As you can see, it's got some hearts and some type of design on it. But I can't even hold it in my hand, so where did it go? There it is. Yeah, you can see the design a little bit. That's pretty neat. Some old jewelry. So, all right, let's see what else we can find. All right, guys, so I was getting a high signal in this hole right here, and it looks about to be five or six pennies just in this hole alone. So that was ringing up in the high 20s, but always double check your plugs and make sure that there's nothing else left in it. So, pretty cool. All right, see you here on the next one. Maybe. All right, guys, so here's John, the Equinox Hunter, and I'm pretty sure I just pulled number 59 out of this plug. We're gonna let him pull it out and look at it. I hope I didn't hit it with my digger, though. And I got it. Ringing up good, 12, 13. Can you pull it out? Yeah, you can. Go ahead and clean it off and see what we got. It felt like I hit it with my digger. I hope I didn't, though. Did it look like I chipped it at all, my digger? Don't look. Uh, it's a 9.5. That's the size. Uh, I don't know. It just says ring size. I don't know if that's silver or what it is. What was it ringing up as? What was it saying? Yes. Ring size. Five. It was definitely heavy. All right, well, ring number 59, I believe, so. All right, see you guys here in the next one. All right, guys, so she's all cleaned up. Uh, I looked on the inside of it, and it says U.S. ring size 9.5. Uh, I'm not sure if it's titanium or tungsten carbide, but that's definitely heavy. And like I said, it was ringing up as a 12 or 13. So, uh, yeah, ring 59 for the year. Pretty excited. So let's uh, get to 60. See you here in the next one. All right, guys, so I just had a ring number 59 a little while ago, and I think that uh, the Equinox Hunter over here is starting to bring me some good luck. What do you think it is, John? Hold on, let's, I'm going to turn the camera right. around. So, so there's the ring right there. Let's pull it out and see what we got. Look like I got a gold ring. Yeah. So that makes number 60. We were just talking about it before I hit the signal. <laughs> My goal is uh, 75 rings for the year. That's, uh, can't make out what that says. Yeah, we're gonna, I'm going to clean it up real fast, see what it is. But uh, awesome, guys. See you here in the next one. All right, guys. So it's got another strong signal. This one was ringing up at about a 1920 sure what it is looks like a heart or some sort I'm sure if it goes on like a necklace or something but it's got some type of writing on the back of it I'm seeing if I can wipe it off you can kind of see the engraving in it on that side and then the opposite side it looks possibly like a heart of some sort it's got a little bit of dirt on it but there you go you can see it a little bit better pretty neat all right guys see you here in the next one so I just got another high signal on this hole right here. It's ringing up in the 20s. I'm gonna pull this little thing out. I'm sure it is like a charm or something, maybe. Just put the dirt off the plug. Looks like it goes on a necklace or something. They pull a little design on the front though. See little things in it, that's pretty cool looking. All right guys, see you here in the next one. Alrighty everybody, so I just finished up my hunt for the day and I had a heck of a day. I got ring number 59 and ring number 60 
and there's my jewelry for the day. That one right there looks like it was a full bracelet. It broke up into a whole bunch of different pieces. Got that little charm. I got the cross, and I got that cool little heart thing. And then here's my coins for the day. Got a bunch of quarters, a decent amount of dimes, some nickels, a whole bunch of pennies. And there's my trash pile for the day. Happy I was wearing gloves, because if I would've hit my hand on that, I might've cut myself open. So, hope you guys enjoyed the hunt. And uh, we'll be back out to do some more here soon. And if you haven't already checked out uh, John's channel, it's called the Equinox Center. So, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll talk to you soon.